All right, guys, we're here to talk about the new camera, the G4 Camera Doorbell Pro. It's amazing. It looks just awesome. It's black. It's cool. It kind of has that premium feel, which a lot of companies go for. They kind of justify the colors different from their products. Sometimes it doesn't work out that way good, but this one looks awesome. It looks premium as heck. There's a lot of cool features, it seems like, in this. Let's talk about them. Let's get right into it. Before we start it, though, my ear... I nicked it, it's bleeding all over, so I put a band-aid on it, yeah. But let's look at something cool, let's not worry about this thing, let's look at something cool now. All right, we got the door, we got the nice lens on it, five megapixel lens now, compared to the three and the old one, so it's a huge upgrade in uh, quality of picture. We got better talking, we can see from the app just like before, you can scroll through your timeline, so it works good. Now, we got a downward facing camera. So the cool thing about this is, now you can see packages at your door. But if you have a huge house, like, I mean, a big, big house, you know, 6,000, 10,000, 9,000 or bigger, um, depending on how big your front door is, you might not be able to see the packages still, depending where they put them. So you might have to say, because I know there's a little screen on there, leave packages at door or all that stuff if they're sensing, but you might have to tell them, leave the package underneath the doorbell so they can see it. So you guys can see it from upstairs. So that'd be nice. Like you're upstairs in your office, you have a huge house. You could be sitting up there and be like, oh, I'm waiting for that package. It's not here yet. I mean, obviously if your house is super, super big, you have gates and they can't even get up to your front door anyways, or they can't even get up to your property anyways. So um, you gotta think about that way too. Obviously you're not gonna be letting, if you're a rich or like a super like billionaire or famous person, you're not gonna want the UPS guy going to your door. Hey, you might it might not matter. You might have a drop off spot in front of your house where you could have this too. Hey, I don't. You know, it's definitely possible at your front gate before you let people in. You can be like, hey, that's what's so cool about these doorbells. I see so many of these that people should use them. Is if you have a huge property, your internet's good or whatever, um, or you can some of these new cameras now. You can start um, putting um, Ethernet out there or whatever. So if you have a property and you have a front gate that you like to buzz people in, why well, have an intercom? When you can have a doorbell, you can do video chat with them. You can look at it. You can look who came in through the gate that day. I mean, I think that's pretty dang cool. You can ring the doorbell. I mean, it's pretty awesome. These doorbells are getting really cool. But I love Unifies because you're not locked into a contract. You can record it on your own uh, NVRs without having to worry about... Um, paying cloud storage fees or any of that stuff so that's pretty dang nice plus um you get a lot more faster timelines you can do with these two and so i'm very very excited about this doorbell this doorbell just seems to kick all the endpoint notes and everything and like you'd want a doorbell it's just it's pretty crazy the one thing it doesn't have that i think i haven't seen watched the whole thing is it doesn't have uh, a number pad on it, but why would you need a number pad on your doorbell? I don't know. That, yeah, see, it's stupid. Yeah, but I just thought in case you want to put a code in or something, you know, to unlock your door from your doorbell or whatever. But yeah, you don't need it. But let's go. I'm sorry for ranting. All right, so putting the package in the door. You can see the quality is great. Really good. You get your timelines. You get your smart um, tracking and everything for cars and people on it. So that's pretty cool. Shows the motion with the green light. Night vision, night vision's been improved. It looks great. I mean, the quality just looks really good. I mean, look at that. It looks awesome right there. We got a light too that lets you know when you get home or something, it'll detect you. It's probably, I don't know, they don't say how it's gonna detect you. It could be motion or it could be your phone. That'd be pretty cool too. So if somebody, well, I guess if so, anybody comes to your door, you'd wanna kinda light it up saying, hey, somebody's coming to the door. But it would be cool if you could do both. Maybe you're just like, well, you know what, I have my camera's night vision. I know when somebody's coming, but maybe when I come only, since I have protect on my phone and it has um, your geolocation on it, when you come up or getting close to the door, the light turns on, that'd be pretty cool. And it'll only do it for the people that you give that access to. That'd be pretty cool, that'd be cool. Yeah, look, there it is, looks nice. I mean, it looks nice, very professional. Now here's the screen, the screen's pretty cool. You can put, I wonder if you can do custom. I haven't seen one yet, so I don't know if you can do custom pictures. It kind of looks custom, but that could just be the Unify one that they just have with it. But that'd be cool if you could put uh, your own animations on it. That'd be pretty cool, your own messages and stuff. It kind of looks like the screen that you would see on, um, not the Elgato, but the uh, stream decks and stuff where you could do your own, um, pictures and your quick tabs and stuff it kind of looks like that but instead this is just a message board so you can put cool messages in i hope you can upgrade put your own pictures and animations in that'd be cool your own gifs and stuff that'd be pretty cool and neat oh 
Also, it'd be cool if you could do Christmas ones too. That'd be cool. And I don't know if you can do this one, but if anybody does this, I know you can do it in some doorbells, but it would be cool if you could upload your own tunes. That would be awesome. You know, you log into your smart doorbell. So depending on the holiday or if you just want a certain ringtone that you want, anything, not just certain ones. It should be any, any one that you have or any uh, MP3 file that you have that you can make it into a ringtone. So you ring your doorbell, it'll play that song through the house or play different doorbell chimes or bell chimes or whatever. That would be legit, but this one, I don't think this one does it, but that just... Just for ideas, it'd be cool. All right, so, oh, yep, we have the voice. The voice is really good. The voice has been improved apparently over the old one, so that's really good. And the ring, the ring can now go through the house too and all your devices, so it could be ringing in your house. So you can hear it on your phone better too if you're not in the same area, other than just the regular doorbell ring. And it has a thumbprint reader that works with Access. It would be cool if Unify is watching this video, if they would make a doorknob that has the ring stuff in your vault. I know they have a lot of smart doorknobs out there now with keypads, NFCs. So I know they have their access, but if they could add a door to their access, like, you know, the cool door, um, door you know, charge it up. That's okay, I'm fine with doing Dorley Charge Up as long as it's unified, that'd be cool. Because then you could have it connect with Access, like a house door, I mean you could do office doors too, but let's start with house doors because the office kind of gets all the other Access stuff that most people wouldn't have in their house. But a front door knob that has a smart Access, anybody can use that too, that would just be cool. And then this would be cool, uh, you could just touch it and it would unlock your door, that would be awesome. Or if they even put it on a doorknob, who knows, the touch on the doorknob. That'd be cool. There's so many applications for this. That'd be so awesome. Think about this. Think if you have a whole bunch of people that like friends or family that drop off stuff at the house and you have a special bin outside. Well, if you can link it where you can make um, the access, they have like, you know, the smart lock. I mean, the smart locks, but like the access locks that you can hook up to the access panel. You can put any locks on it. You can have a bin out there that's bolted to the ground that you have the access to use the locking mechanism on it. And if somebody comes up and they go, oh, I'm leaving something in there, or they just touch the doorbell, it unlocks that so they can put their packages inside there safely. And that when somebody else uh, in the family who has their you know, thumbprint saved in there can do it again and open it up when they get home without worrying about them getting stolen. So that'd be kind of cool. Just a cool little thing right there I'm just thinking of. It's definitely possible with that. You could definitely do it. Yep, there it is, thumbprint unlocked. So that would be definitely cool. I would see. I wonder if you could have multiple ones that does or does. If you hold it, oh, that'd be cool. Oh, it even shows the you know, the time outside and the weather. It's just awesome. It works with your existing wiring, so that is awesome too. Plugs in, nice connectors. You can do uh, USB C powering it too with the plug inside if you want to do that. That's really cool. And now they've added the PoE. So I mean, the dongle is pretty big. I'm not gonna lie. It would be cool if it's smaller. But, I mean, now that I'm thinking about it, I mean, you could always put that PoE uh, thing somewhere else and get an, uh, an extender, because it's USB-C in the end. Just get a USB-C uh, female and plug that one into it and extend it longer, and maybe you don't have to have it right there in the cabinet. You can put it down somewhere, but it is pretty big. But it would be cool if they just had a PoE directly into the um, uh, doorbell, too. That would be awesome. Yep, powering up over PoE. That is cool. They have the turn face plate, so if you want it to be the angle to be turned and stuff, you can turn the angle and stuff to help to see different parts of the door and stuff. You can look at it, you can access it from anywhere. Setup's really easy too. I mean, quick and easy setup, and you can watch it live from anywhere in the world. It's just awesome. It's just awesome camera. It looks amazing. I'm excited for it. It's just rocking and rolling. It's Unify. So get involved. <laughs> get involved, guys. I hope you guys are having a wonderful day. Put this up. I get excited about this stuff. There's just so many possibilities when you think about it, like the, having your packages safe in, I mean, uh, in the front of your door with the little dumper reader for s certain people you give access to. That is just, I think that's really dang cool. Um, but yeah, I think that's just awesome. Just have your friends and family over and say, hey, put your thumb here. We'll add you to the thing. We'll let you use the doorbell that unlocks this one um, bin here for your packages and since packages now are going to start having I guess they're trying to save uh, the environment so they're going to have to start actually not putting them in other boxes they're just going to have them in the box that the retail box they're in so you actually see the picture on it 
So that might make people be like, ooh, they got that, I'm gonna go get that. But if you have it in those bins, it'll be fine. So that even works twice now, because if they come out with their uh, handle for your door that has the touch in it, like a nice, you know, premium nice door handles, it looks cool on a front door of someone's house, that you can have the touch and then a little screen on it too, that'd be cool too, because then you could have one that lets you in the house, and then the one underneath on the doorbell that lets you into the box or your chest that you have there for your packages so nobody can steal them. Great idea. That'd be awesome. But yeah, you can still do that. That's definitely possible. There is, you can put the stuff in there, wire it up. Um, there's going to have to be some drilling involved, obviously, and stuff. But yeah, I mean, there's so many applications for this thing. Let your brain go crazy and have fun. I mean, yeah. All right, guys. Peace out. Have a rock and roll day. Hit that like button. Hit subscribe every time I get excited. Remember, my whole motto is watch everyone's video. Just don't watch my video. Watch everyone's because everybody has different takes on everything. And you learn different stuff every time. And it makes your brain move. And that's all good at making our brain move. So let's get smart. And let's think of cool ideas to make this world a better place. Rock on. Rock out. Peace out.